There is no ethical consumption under capitalism. The key is diminishing returns. While you should pay attention to your consumption, you cannot remove the harm from the system that made it. Capitalism is ableist. You can reduce the harm, but it means the situation still continually gets worse. All we can do is shove more and more labor in to minimize it. This infinite labor sink consumes effort with essentially no additional payoff. Boycotts when companies get worse in lockstep, for example. We must eat. It's also either individualist or harmful. Your minimum is not mine. Not everyone can use paper straws. We all live paycheck to paycheck, reducing harm costs money, so either we consume less or accept more harm somewhere else. We all know where the metals and solar panels come from. Do you choose less carbon or slavery? To end the harm, we must build new systems. We make them with the same money and time we use to reduce harm. So first, harming yourself for harm reduction is counterproductive. Less energy means less change, including harm reduction. Please eat enough if you can. Second, measure the resources you use on mitigations like boycotts and have it. Use savings on building new systems. I suggest gardening. Involving others is safer. It's creating options. Changing one aspect of the lives of a hundred people does a lot more than any reduction for just yourself. Mutual aid gets the goods.